In this episode of Comp TV, we are talking about different styles of waltz for the drum set. <laughs> yes, and be sure to like and subscribe for more epic musical content. Now, the waltz is 3-4 time. It's in 3-4 time, I should say. And it's a style of dance, which is where it gets its name. And basically, all these grooves are going to be three quarter notes long. 3-4, not to be confused with 6-8. And so, the basic waltz pattern is just kick, snare, snare, kick, snare, snare. I'm going to throw in some variations. You can also play two and three on the hi-hat. I like to leave the hi-hat off of beat one and you really accent the different pulses here. Boom, ka, ka, boom, ka, ka. By doing that, and so this particular type of waltz with the hi-hat added, I hear a lot in mariachi styles of music. Sometimes 3-4 isn't just counted in 3, sometimes it's actually counted in 1, as in we are just playing a compound beat. If the music is too fast and you're playing with an orchestra, sometimes the conductor will count the 3-4 passages in 1. 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3. And sometimes your part might even not accentuate all 3 beats. Sometimes your part is going to sound like this. All right, now let's talk about the Viennese waltz. I really like this waltz because it just takes the first hit that you would normally do on the snare and brings it back an eighth note. We're playing on the and of one. Mm -ka, ka, mm -ka, ka. But essentially, the basic Viennese waltz is gonna sound like this. And I will sometimes use that Viennese waltz pattern on the snare and use it as my comping rhythm when I play a jazz waltz. Now, the jazz waltz, the basic idea is that you're swinging on the two and, but you can also do the three and, you can combine them both. Elvin Jones would even accent the and on his ride cymbal pattern. And a lot of times I see kick, hi-hat, hi-hat written, like this over the ride cymbal pattern when I open a book on what a jazz waltz is. And a lot of times people in bands will just want you to play two on the hi-hat. And again, as I show you some variations in a bit, I can even do the Viennese waltz comping with the hi-hat. And I've heard a lot of great drummers do that like Max Roach and Elvin Jones. Alright, so there's some variations with the jazz waltz, just a basic idea of what you can do there. And speaking of Max Roach in jazz, a very famous drum solo called The Drums Also Waltz can be found opening with this pattern on the drums. And also John Bonham copied Max Roach's idea at the beginning of his drum solo in the Royal Albert Hall performance, which is my favorite drum solo of all time. Anyways, it's gonna sound like this. In 
other waltzes in the swing idiom is the country waltz, where a lot of times I hear them played with the snare actually on one with the kick, and you're also going to add some swing in there. And then two and three on the hi-hat. This particular style of country waltz I hear a lot uh, by the Johnny Cash drummer W.S. Holland. I hear him play this version of the country waltz quite a bit in Johnny Cash's music. I also did a video on him. So once you get a good understanding of playing a waltz and just feeling three, four time, if you're new to it, of course, is to just make up your own rhythms. And one of my favorite rhythms made up by one of my favorite contemporary drummers, Nathan Followell from the Kings of Leon, is the beat in The Runner off of Because of the Times. And there you have it, just a few different styles of waltz for the drum set. If you know any other types of waltz, please leave a comment. Be sure to like and subscribe for more epic musical content. And in case I don't see you, good afternoon, good evening, and good night. <laughs> Looking for that perfect gift for your loved one this holiday season? I was just gifted these Bruce Lee nunchucks by the fine folks at Highlander Shop. Maybe your sibling is looking for a Demon Slayer sword to complete their cosplay, or even a Keyblade from Kingdom Hearts. Highlander Shop has your pop culture needs covered. Plus, you can get 10% off of your purchase by using promo code COBB. That's C-O-B-B -B in all caps for 10% off of your purchase today.